I went to a Christmas parade this weekend because my daughter was on a float. The parades here in my little corner of Texas are always kicked off by the local university's marching band. If you've never seen the Texas A&M University marching band, it's pretty impressive to see. Admittedly, they're a little monochromatic, but it's consistent with the school's roots as a military academy. I'll give you a little taste of this low-quality video I took with my phone. The plot thickens after this clip. My Texas town is surrounded by rural areas filled with conservatives who hold conservative values. But it's also a college town, total permanent resident population of 130,000 people. But there are over 50,000 students, in addition, that attend Texas A&M and a small college, Blinn, in the Bryan College Station area. So we had a new entry this year in our little municipal Christmas parade. They are the Brazos Valley Vuvuzela Atheist Band. They come in blowing Vuvuzela horns to the tune of We Wish You a Merry Christmas. Here's the clip. I'll ask a question afterwards. Impressive collection of musicians, right? So here's the question for you. No one would argue that they don't have a right to do this. But was it a good idea? Tell me why you think it was or wasn't a good idea in the comments below. Video responses are always welcome. I can say that the crowd went eerily quiet when they marched by. There were, by my count, six organizations with explicitly religious messages or affiliations. There was also the Sons of Confederate Veterans, two church groups, and two Christian motorcycle clubs. For the most part, the parade was secular and municipal in nature. Lots of fire departments, tractors, high school bands, and local social or charity groups. I don't want to bias you by stating my opinion. I'm interested in hearing yours. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to your comments.